What's going on guys? Skoog the Boo Boog here, back with some more Choo Choo Charles. Not gonna waste your time, let's get right into it. So I want to focus more on, I think, speed and power. Speed is key and power is... Uh, Power is the power is power. Yeah. Where am I? Oh shit! Actually, I need to go back. Speed. Speed needs to be key for this. I should outrun the guy. Right? That's how you solve all your problems is running away from it. I've been fighting on the railroad all oh, the dude I day. I've been dying on the railroad all oh, live long day. I've been Crapping my pants all a long day. Is there a way to get rid of that? Charles, be a good boy now. Be, be a good Eldrith horror and don't fucking screw me over, bro. The monster hunter has arrived, I see. And the non-articulating mouths have returned. This is no ordinary hunt, mind you. We've already tried fighting Charles, but he retreats into the wilderness if he is sufficiently harmed. Okay. Fucking bastard's lucky he's got legs. We believe there may be a way to get Charles to commit to a mortal battle, however. Mortal battle, huh? Why not in Mortal One? Forever, forever bloodshed between trains. We'll call it the train games, right? Make a good show of it. Be great reality TV. Dispersed around the island are three eggs, locked in the island's three primary mines. Our theory is that putting these eggs in the temple at the center of the island will. Provoke Charles into a fight to the death. You creep me out more than Charles with your just lifeless eyes. Unfortunately, the mining company owner, Warren Charles III, has placed armed guards inside each mine to protect the eggs. You just dismount the machine gun, light it up. There's an egg in the mine just down the rail. Here's the key to the mine. I've marked the entrance on your map. Let me in. Let me tell you about his brininess. All right, now I'm going to stop at that. I'm going to look for more scrap because I want to increase my speed and power. Good thing this train has unlimited fuel and ammunition. All right. Well, I'm done here. Ooh, more scrap. More scrap. Yes. I shall be biggest and strongest train. Transport most people. Get there on time, bro. Oh shit! I need to like increase my fucking t train's health, Lord. Um. Yeah, I feel safe enough. Or I don't know. Maybe I'm just stupid, but I can make it. Scrap over. I gotta fucking heal up the train. Quit with the sc scattering. Stop. 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 I don't like it. Go away. Oh, 
such a shame. Fellow dead brethren, fellow train. May, may you rest in peace. Okay. <clears throat> I'll stop fucking around for a minute. I should try to do something smart ish. I was about to say, if you don't let me in, I fucking see you, dude. You can't hide from me. Look, kid. I know you're supposed to be some fancy pants monster hunter, but you can't earn my respect without making yourself useful. I mean, like, isn't that kind of the whole point? One of Warren's goons dumped a locked chest in the yard last night. After beating on it for a few hours, I didn't break anything but a sweat. <laughs> Judging by you, bro, you, you could use it. I got some lock picks, but I don't know how to use them. Here, take them. If you can get that chest open, you'll earn my respect. I might just give you some scraps to help improve your train. <laughs> Where are y'all collecting the scrap from? You just seem to have a surplus of it. Everyone's just like, yeah, I'll give you scrap. Damn it. Damn it. God damn it. No, stop. <laughs> I swear I'm smarter than this. Critical arm required. Return to Daryl to complete your mission. I'm getting inside so I feel semi safe from Charles. Ancient tablet, a very old stone tablet that features some strange drawings. It looks like a spider. All right, Daryl. <laughs> well, fancy fingers here got the chest unlocked. <laughs> Glass ain't Skyrim where they can break, because... <laughs> uh, that's an odd-looking piece of junk you found inside there. Bit of a letdown, to be frank. What is up with those, your fucking arms, bro? You earned my respect, so here's some scraps, <laughs> like I promised. To unlock the train, he's like... You have my respect, man. Good man. Good man. Okay, it's not raining. That's nice. I don't want to hear that all night long. Speed up so I'll be fast as fuck, boy. Holy shit! <laughs> now I can go back to the pickle cave. I'm coming for you, my lord. Just wait. Catch me, boy! Can't catch me. Okay, he might be able to catch me. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind.
Alright, so I survived an encounter with Charles. Great. Great. Fantastic. We'll go here. Oh, nice. Hopefully he can't fucking get in here and this is a little spot where I can have a break. So I'll just I'm fucking going for it. Tell you what, that motherfucker puts up a fight. Holy shit. Headshots really fucking count on him. Like, god damn, fuck. Okay, maybe I want to invest in armor because part of me thinks that no matter how how much I upgrade my speed, I'd probably never be able to outrun him. So, you know, maybe there's some value to armor. Some value of these fucking explosives, but no, I can't fucking take them. Oh, I got on the fucking train. Hello? Ooh, nice place. Hello. Welcome to Araniram, Archivist Museum Theodore. person. Theodore Wimbledon, my old colleague. How long has it been since we last spoke? Oh, I think it was at the Cthulhu exhibit, wasn't it? Oh, so good to see you. How has your family been? Uh, my apologies. I'm not the best with introductions, but I don't believe either of us are here for socializing. <laughs> oh, you never were the socializing type, Theodore. <laughs> I just so happen to have a little business opportunity, if you're interested. Well, so long as that business opportunity involves explosives, maybe? So long as that business involves the occult and... Fine vintages. A very special little box of mine is in a rail car in the nearby canyon. But the goons have set up a camp to protect that area. <coughs> so be careful. Can I mount guns on other parts of my tank? Find so the tank blue on my box train and bring it back to me. I feel like that'd be helpful so I could shoot I'll at other give things. You some scraps as payment. I feel like I feel like things you pay me besides scrap, but Sure. I'll just take some scrap here because, you know, you're not going to stop me. Before the cave-in, I pushed a spare rail car into the canyon using my beautiful old mining train. I figured a rail car would be a fine place to hide my more important belongings, especially on a rural and unfinished, un -rural, on a rural and unfinished track. English. I want to get something out of my rail car in the canyon about a week ago but some of Warren's men have built a campsite or base of some sort there. I don't know how to get my box safely, and I don't know how long it'll last without it, or how long I'll last without it. Let's hope these, so Warren, this must be quite the uh, character. Uh, let's hope that Warren's men are susceptible to bullets Oh shit, there's actually like, yeah, there's visual changes to the train when you upgrade it. Cool. So where am I having to go for this? Uh, Alright, I guess we'll go with the fucking... So yeah, no, I'm not gonna be able to use fucking bullets for it. train tracks I can use. Damn it. Oh, 
Oh, you know what? What happens if I just go in there? No visitors allowed! Woo! Ow! Punch him, punch him! Oh, oh God. <clears throat> Hey, can I get a gun? That would that would be nice. <laughs> so yeah, looking at this, I don't think there's some way for me to like bring my train over there. Yeah, no. Fuck. Alright, we were on the right Alright, hang on. I think we were on the right track there. So I'm gonna go up this hill and just scout it out a little bit. God, I got that fucking railroad song stuck in my head. <laughs> God, I'm thinking about like all the songs I can think of that have something to do with train. Like I got the Thomas the Tank Engine song in my fucking head. Right Nobody, don't fucking worry about it. So they have a very wide range of view. Might get killed. Fast as fuck, boy. You don't know where I am. Oh, come meet me, my train. I got a little gun for you too. Oh, shoot way more bullets than you. Cool. Hey, bro. That's the exact box I needed. Cool. The house. Scraps and skedaddle. I'll see you at the next gala theater. <laughs> Very good friend of mine, me and Theodore. We, we like to spend our time together enjoying the finest of vintages and snootiest of laughter. <laughs> Alrighty, that's a pretty swanky ass looking temple there. Is there something for me to like tag Charles? That'd be kind of cool. So what do I do if I'm going in reverse and Charles hits me from the front? Holy shit. Bro, get some more damage in there, bro. I don't think the machine guns gets beefed up anyway, but still, good to have the damage. Dude, honestly, looking at this, like, I'm fucking fully upgraded, like, no time.
off. Go back to your goddamn Eldrith realm. God almighty, bro. Oh, hey. Nobody likes you. I know you're upset that you didn't get the odd the part in Thomas and Friends, but bro. Take that up with your fucking agent, not me. The armor might be a better uh, investment. This is where I started. Anything of value here worth getting on here? More scrap, maybe? I think I got nothing. Forward onto new horizons! Go forth and collect scrap. Beautiful night. Just gotta love it, you know. Quit with the choir. What would it be like to ride on a train like this? Be fun. Hi, right, Charles. I would like to get to the pickle lady and get the pickle jar and get more scrap so I can, you know have a better chance of killing you, so don't attack me this time, okay? Pinky promise. All right, Charles, leave me alone. Please don't do nothing insane. I'm coming for you, holy pickles. You are the one true religion of the world. You represent the preservation of goodness and greatness. Shh. 
I'm fine. No, I'm fine. It's cool. It's fine. We're all okay. Nothing to worry about. Now we're good. Oh, I like the rain. It's fine. It's just noise. Who, who the fuck be scared of noise? I'm not scared of noise. Shut up. I'm not running because I'm scared. I'm running because I'm trying to, you know, not skip on cardio day. Blessed be the pickle, the brine, and the holy dill. You are my pickle hero! Oh, thank you. It means so much your words. Here are some scraps as a reward for your valiant pickle questing. Here, I'll pickle quest for you any day. I'll give you a nice fat pickle any day of the week. Just call me, let me know. Bring, bring one right over. Ooh, nice. Okay. Me, me likes. Me likes a lot. Alrighty. Alright, well. Alright, well, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.